what's up guys this is PDA phone junkie here I'm here to show you my new uh, series of clean ROMs uh, I'm gonna video the ones for the Vogue uh, I gotta get some testers first before the uh, Apache and Titan ROMs are released I don't have any uh, Apache or Titans right now to test them on so um, I can't you know I'm not gonna release them without knowing that they really work good first um, but don't worry I still have a lot of love for all this stuff I just have been busy and haven't had uh, enough time to cook ROMs and stuff but I'm back doing it now I got time so uh, it's been a lot of fun and uh, I'm gonna go ahead right now and show you the uh, ROM for the Vogue right here and uh, I'm a little sore I fell off of a three-wheeler today uh, riding in the field here behind my home and uh, with one of my buddies and just having some fun so my legs and back are kind of sore but anyways uh, let's go ahead and take a look at this so I'm gonna flip the camera around okay so uh, here we are for close-up now this is my new logo it has a version right here PDA phone drug and clean ROMs Telecaster custom uh, it's my favorite type of guitar it's a Telecaster headstock love playing the old tellies uh, so here's version 1.0, and this is the Windows Mobile 6.1. So I'm releasing both a 6.1 and a uh, 6.5 um, version uh, because personally I prefer 6.1 right now, um, but some people want 6.5 and others want 6.1. So whatever you want, uh, it's there. And of course, I'm always happy to build uh, custom ROMs for people with specific applications that they want built into the ROM uh, hit me up send me a private message and uh, I'll work with you uh, my buddy TMZ uh, was really nice and uh, worked with him to get him a custom ROM and stuff and I actually ended up using it on my device for a long time because I really loved it uh, and it was his suggestions and stuff so anyways we're running Manila 2D here you know what that is uh, probably pretty cool you can add contacts and I don't have any contacts loaded in because this is just a test here I just uh, flash this one over uh, after I'm happy with it and everything uh, so I don't have my personal data loaded in here right now then we can add programs uh, oh you just hit it once there and uh, when you're gonna add a new program so if I want to add the calculator just go ahead and add the calculator select and then I uh, can open that up so real easy, you can add uh, however many you want, a lot of space there. Uh, you can also navigate to this with the D-pad uh, and stuff. And that's my clock back there, sorry about that. Uh, so our home screen, we have the digital clock, nothing unusual, this is just black. I, I have the classic black TSK theme. You can customize it however you wish. Uh, a lot of guys have fun with this. I personally think it's a very useful interface. Um, anyhow and you don't have to use your stylus for pretty much most of this I got kind of fat fingers and it works just fine uh, if you go through here you can go up like that uh, the Verizon version will include wireless sync because some of you guys use that for your business uh, needs and stuff so that's all there for you uh, very minimal programs added in most of this is just from the base uh, Windows Mobile base and this is the latest Windows Mobile 6.1 build. So here is PHM Reg Edit because uh, a lot of guys need to be able to edit their registry. And then we have Manila 2D Customizer. So that way uh, you can kind of change up the way that uh, the appearance of that. So that's pretty fun. You should know what that is uh, if you use Manila 2D. Uh, if not, it's really easy to learn. Um, and not too much else here. We have all the tools that you need. We do have the Vogue camera loaded which is uh, pretty good if I follow this here uh, you can see here here's my kitchen over there uh, kitchen table chair right there anyhow uh, so that's the camera so it's all there um, nothing unusual and uh, we do have HTC Auto Manager as well as Windows Media Player we only have the solitaire and bubble breaker games because I wanted to leave this real clean uh, so that way you guys can add in whatever you need um, if you want a lot of other stuff like I said go ahead and send me a message I'm gonna plug this in here uh, get it connected up and this is my personal setup I I think active sync connects faster with that when it has that little pop-up if you remove the advanced uh, connections 
So I got my laptop over here, my vial. And uh, we're going to use this as a gateway to connect to the internet. So as soon as this is connected, we go ahead. And so we have Internet Explorer. I like using Skyfire as well. Uh, that's another really good one. Uh, also, uh, Opera Mobile is another great one. There's all kinds of browsers up there that you can get. So the, by default, it opens up the Verizon homepage for the Verizon ROM. Uh, we can open up something like Google. And uh, again, the stock keyboard. Personally, I use a SVB keyboard because I like uh, the large keys and then also the full screen mode. But there's a ton of great keyboards out there. I mean, come on, this is Windows Mobile. Uh, you know, you can use just about whatever you want. So here it is, and then you can change the view and all that. You know, nothing unusual. It's not the greatest web browsing experience but it does work and you can pan around between pages like that and go to local whatever you want to search up so anyways uh, just a very clean ROM but you guys can add whatever you wish to and that's my goal that we all have fun with these ROMs uh, personally it's a blast I love it and uh, it's unfortunate that I haven't had the time that I wish I had uh, to play with this stuff but I've got the time now and so I'm back to tweaking and messing around and better than ever so take care guys uh, oh one last thing we're gonna go ahead and take a look at memory uh, so we'll go ahead and go and you can see there's pretty much no lag uh, right now we have 68 free if we close our programs if we go down here to the task manager real quick uh, Internet Explorer was using about a megabyte uh, so we can close that and calculator and then PHM registry editor. Uh, so we have 71.42 megabytes for your RAM. Uh, storage is going to depend on your cache uh, and what else? Oh, nice cyst on my finger there. Uh, whatever you have loaded in. I have nothing loaded in right now through cabs or anything. Uh, so or any personal data so storage is about at 150 almost megabytes and uh, we have a total of 104 built in the OS uses around 30 plus megabytes uh, so anyhow it's uh, lots of free RAM more free RAM than the Touch Pro 2 from a variety I'm sorry the Touch Pro 1 from Verizon uh, so you've got a lot to play around with here and uh, I'm always looking to improve uh, my ROMs, and uh, it's very fun. Thank you to everyone uh, who is on PPC Geeks, who develops, who moderates, uh, the PPC Kitchen team uh, for the builds and everything that everybody contributes uh, to the community. Thank you very much. Uh, thank you to the people who have sent me nice messages uh, and who have donated. That's never required, um, but it's appreciated. And uh, I'm always happy to help anybody that I can. Sometimes I do take a little while to get to PMs uh, when I get in there to check them out and stuff. But I will always reply to everyone as soon as I can. Um, and I'm happy to share any knowledge that I have with anyone. So uh, coming up next will be a video on uh, how to flash these things. This will help out some of our new users um, who have questions. And I have guides posted at PPC Geeks and everything. And uh, I'm really happy to be back and working on the phones. And uh, take care, everyone. This is PDA Phone Junkie here.